Hello everybody, Sift here again, and today I will be playing A Clumsy Flight. Now the game is a roguelike survivors game, so to speak, you know, bullet heaven, bullet hell, etc. But uh, it's it's a very simplistic one at that, and also a very small one, so uh, I decided to go play it a bit. Now I played this a bit before, I have played like three or four runs. Uh, I unlocked all the characters and uh, pretty much all the everything that there is to unlock, honestly. Uh, we're gonna go with a character here that just levels up faster, because, you know, more levels, more bustedness. And and uh, yeah, let's go into the select screen here. Uh, now I have some things that I haven't unlocked yet, obviously. But the thing is, like, uh, if you win just once, you get so much money, you unlock whatever you see unlocked already. So there's that. And I'm gonna pick here the, in my opinion, best plane. And also, in my opinion, best starting weapon. And let's actually do a run in the first stage. And uh, let's see how this is gonna go. So we are a little plane, obviously. Right? Uh, is this? Okay, we are a little plane, obviously. And, uh, yeah, what we want to do is just do what all planes do. Literally stay in the middle, don't move at all, and just whatever comes close to us, we destroy it. That's the plan. Uh, new weapon, pistol, I'm, I don't want the new weapon. We have only two weapon slots, by the way, because, you know, this is a plane and we have only two weapon slots. We definitely don't want a pistol, we want something like a normal machine gun. Uh, let's go with this. Uh, infuse fire. Deal one damage every two seconds. Or new weapon, pistol, or rotating gun, sniper edition. Uh, yeah, this is just another weapon, by the way, because I'm gonna play on the easy mode, on the easy controls, and the easy controls means that wherever I target, things shoot, and also fly the same. Whatever. Let's go with this. Let's go with the fire. And uh, what I'm trying to explain is that there are two controls. There is a control that uh, the easy control, the simple control, is that uh, wherever you target is also wherever you fly towards. But I have a permanent break uh, here. Uh, have a nice block rotating brave brave shield protect flame from one hit 25 percent damage on weapons while active that is good uh have ice block orbiting you for a plane or deal to damage you know what we're gonna take the bravery shield let's go with a 25 percent more damage while it is active so now i am one shotting opponents as um, yeah they have 20 life now as you can see the graphics are extremely pixelized like more than it's possible to read things that's how pixelized there is but this is the style of the game anyway rotating shield have one shield orbit around your plane uh, the shield disarm damage rotating sniper gun again and enemies explode death we're gonna go with enemies explode this sounds good but you can only have one rotating thing and you can also have only one um uh, manual aimed weapon mounted on your weapon uh, on your plane and i don't want these i don't want the rotating shield i also don't want the sniper so we're gonna go with the passive here of opponents die uh, you can have as many passives as you want but you can only have as i said uh, yeah, here, for example, once again, rotating ice block, and uh, this is the weapon we have. I'm gonna go with 27% more damage on the weapon we have. In general, having more damage is good. I also see rotating gun, which is one of the better ones, in my opinion, because it shoots often. But, I mean, the sniper is also really good. But there are, like, grenade launchers and rocket launchers as your minor weapon, and I'm gonna try to take those. Uh, spread, I don't care about that. Fire rate is pretty decent. 10% fire rate is... Uh, yeah, that, that is decent-ish, so let's take that. They are randomized. Whatever upgrades you roll for your weapons are randomized. So I think the best attack speed I've found is like 50%. 33% damage is really good right now. Uh, gr rotating grenade launcher is also really good. And cooling down weapons. Uh, weapons heat up less fast, allow you to repair faster. This is also really good. Uh, a mechanic here I want to explain is this red bar is my overheat. Uh, but overheat does not affect you negatively if you have it maxed out. If anything, you want to have it very low to heal. The, the way you heal in this game is if you don't shoot at all, this overheat goes down to zero. And then you start healing life. So uh, yeah, this is just gonna make it as it said allows you to repair faster that's like the only aspect of not having overheat but we're gonna go with 33 percent damage that is also a pretty uh big amount come on bugs let's take it so we, we want to be doing in general a lot of damage like that's the plan and also really important is uh here, here for example you see how low that how slowly that goes down we found that again this is for example a trash upgrade this is also a trash upgrade i have even seen minus 95 percent decrease spread so this is like completely useless uh let's go this cooling uh, cooling down the gun a bit faster uh, which won't really affect anything, honestly, because uh, the plan is to never lose life at all. A new weapon pistol, a new weapon dual pistols or 29% damage. I'm gonna go with a 29% damage. Uh, I do, yeah, prefer it over the choices that we got there. The plan is to get another machine gun, like an AK. I mean, I think I have the AK-47 already, so if I get like an M14 or something, um, it's gonna be good. Okay, we found a new weapon, shoots bullets at very high fire rate that deal 4 damage. This is decent-ish, but 12% machine gun is crazy good. 12% uh, attacks with the machine gun, so we're gonna take that. We still are searching for my second weapon, obviously. But, uh, yeah, for now, we haven't found it. 
Okay, I found this again. Increased fire by 2%. As you see, this is trash. Uh, decreased fire by 12, also very mediocre. I think I'm going to go with this. Shoots bullets at a very high fire rate that deal 4 damage. And that's going to be my um, small damage weapon, I guess. I guess. I guess. Whatever. Let's see what this is. Okay, it's like just a crazy machine gun. Ah, I don't feel good about it, but it is what it is. Now I have my good damaging machine gun that does like 50 damage. And then I have my trash machine gun that does 4 Plane that follow you around the deal 10 damage, decent. Leave behind toxic smoke that deals damage. If I if I would move, it could be good, but I'm not moving, so we're gonna go with piercing 10% chance to pierce, as that is gonna come in handy later when we get like a million opponents chasing us down. I really hope I'm not gonna regret this. Increase damage by 37%, I'm gonna definitely take that. Uh, infuse my bullets with electricity, 20% chance to um, make opponents take 2 damage over time. I think that's the axe. And then randomly attack opponents for four. Oh, we're gonna go with 37% damage on the 4 damage weapon. If that makes it do like 10, we're good. Right now, my normal attack does like 51. Spread, uh, ammo speed, I don't even know what this is. It seems useless to me. We're gonna go with chance to pierce again. I, I do like this, but we're gonna go with chance to pierce. Uh, can I see how much my machine gun does? I mean, does it do 5? Trying to miss. Wow, it only does 5. Insanely bad. Uh, increase damage return percent, that's pretty decent. Fire rate 15% is even more decent. Um, I think I'm gonna go with the 15% fire rate. Like, uh, th this is a, a pretty big amount. Uh, because I think it's multiplicative in this game. And, uh, yeah, that's it. When it hit max, then it's done. <laughs> there is, like, th there are six pips, and then it's full, and then it's max. Like, I don't know why they went that way. Increase armor speed. No, we're gonna go with this. to percent less heating up and uh, faster repair speed. We lose one max life, but that doesn't matter. Uh, because you only die when you hit zero, so... Uh, I will already try to uh, heal when I lose one or two life. I will uh, force healing very quickly. Increase damage return to that's a decent amount, but we're gonna go with Zamor zoom the camera out. I, I can get like 50% damage on this. Uh, you can roll better things. Let's start zooming out the camera. So uh, nothing even uh, will be visible in a moment. Like we won't be able to see anything. <laughs> Grenade launcher. I don't really enjoy it that much. I would prefer the help helper poison plane. You can only have one helper. You can either go with uh, the thing that attacks for 10 damage or you can go with the poison plane. Well, now that I think about it, maybe I should go for the 10 damage thing because I, I won't be moving. Let's just get toxic exhaust. And uh, whenever I move now, I poison opponents. Not that it really matters as the plan is to not move at all. Zoom out. Enemies have a higher chance of exploding. Uh, let's go with the bigger zoom out. Although right now nothing is visible. And as you see, we start moving here because I left the break. <laughs> because I don't want to get super surrounded and die, obviously. Deal more damage with the flame thing. Higher chance to pierce or explode. Let's go with higher chance to pierce. There is a bouncing secret upgrade, but uh, there is a good chance we're not going to get it ever. And now we are actually flying. Now we're actually cruising. Hoping for the best. Increase spread. 25% damage. Once, ah, let's go for it. Let's go for the 25% damage. And now I even leave the poison trail behind. And I'm awesome like that with my little poison. Uh, honestly, I think I should go for the poison plane if I'm able to. Electricity, increase smoke duration, and... Um, nah, both of these are useless. I don't care about spread. Might as well be a million. What I care about is damage. Uh, let's go with increase the duration of the smoke. Could have gone for electric, electric bullets. If they stack. I mean, if electric bullets stack, then obviously the SMG is going to be really good with them. Let's boost our way of these guys. And then look to the back and shoot them. Randomly attack enemies, dealing 4 damage every hit. Or let's go with apply even more flame. Could go for max life, but honestly, I don't I don't really care about max life that much. I Like, the plan is to never get hit anyway. Uh, 23 and then 1% attack speed. Let's go. I, I see a lot around us. Now we're going to go with opponents explode on death. Uh, the thing I hate the most, <laughs> now I have joined them. Now I am the guy that makes opponents explode on death. Whoa, ho, 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 ho. Uh, that, that's like a channel insider thing. And we got this thing. Uh, literally why I wasn't upgrading the the piercing anymore. Because 0% chance to pierce, but bullets will bounce off planes. That's really good. 25% uh, damage though. I'm gonna go for this, though, regardless. 25% damage was a very good roll. But uh, opponents do not attack you, like, at all from afar. There is only literally one opponent, the very final one that attacks you from afar. So it, mass having piercing is... Uh, and there is no detriment to that. Let's go with a uh, poison plane. Now I have a helper that also poison. The reason why I take that is because when you upgrade the helper plane enough, it gives you buffs to the poison itself. So it's gonna make my poison better. <sighs> Increase smoke damage and duration. Chance to freeze opponents when I attack them. That's decent-ish. Let's go with burn opponents when I attack them, as that's gonna increase my DPS of the SMG a lot. Definitely want the SMG to be useful. And now there are elites in this day in this game, and the elites give you like upgrades that pretty much make or break your build. I mean, they don't break your build; they only make your build. Let's go with 10% chance to pierce, and bullets will also bounce. 
I think that's a pretty good upgrade. I hope that's gonna give us like piercing 50 at some point or more. The fact that everything is extremely pixelized. Yeah, that's not YouTube. That is how this game looks. <laughs> 2% fire rate, let's go. <laughs> Increase the smoke damage, rotating big missiles. Have one big missile orbit around your plane. Um, No, I want small missiles. I want rotating small missiles. Let's go increase the smoke duration because the small missiles are a lot more defensive and we just lost our first life. Now I'm gonna stop shooting for a while and I'm gonna be just running around. Whoop. Not when I'm about to lose life. Okay, now now's a good chance to just move around with the poison and I'm full. Nice, and now I can stop again and just smack wherever I see opponents. And here's our first elite, which uh, won't even do anything to us because we're gonna destroy this guy. Uh, ammo speed is still useless. 30% <laughs> more zoom out. I uh, might as well go with a 30% more zoom out because why not? Everything is even more pixelized, that's why not. I can't even see how much damage I'm doing. And we got the kill here on the boss. And the choices are 10 poison damage, 3 fire damage, and 3 electricity damage, which is really good. Uh, double the bullet size, but less ammo speed. That means they move slowly. And plus 20% damage on my current weapons, which are both of them. Increase weapon spots by 1. This is good. This is good. This is good. All of these are good. 10 poison damage is very powerful, because right now the poison does 2 or 3. So this is like tripling, quadrupling the damage for that. And also the fire does 5 right now, so it's going to be 8. Like This is really, really good. Uh, this is also really, really good. Like, all of these are pretty decent. Uh, let's go with an elemental build. Why not? I mean, I already have an attack speed plane anyway, so might as well go for the elemental build. I also have the friend helper already, so I got my bouncy bullets that are gonna apply uh, pretty much fire on everybody. Uh, I want to get my bullets. Rotating missile, this is what I wanted. I'm gonna take that. I see the 15% damage here, which is not 25, so... Enemies killed by the toxic exhaust will explode on toxic bomb. That's also good, but I, I want this as my rotating uh, ability. As I said, you can get one rotating ability, or one flame abil plane ability that is with you, and um, one uh, manual weapon ability. And uh, I just got my rotating missiles, which uh, is this little pixel thing that flies around. Deal five damage from a frame, uh, more poison trail on the poison flame, uh, killed explode. Let's go with five fire damage. As that is 8 in reality, and uh, yeah, I mean, if the SMG hits anything, it's gonna burn them, and then that burn is gonna actually, you know, stack up and destroy your opponents, so that's like the plan here. The SMG applies debuffs, the AK just destroys your opponents right away. <laughs> uh, I think it's time to get this. Have three missiles around you, yeah, that's good. Food, yeah, these are bad upgrades. Let's go with this, terms and chance to electrify the opponents. Uh, it says 2 damage over the duration. Obviously, that's 5 because I have plus 3 electric damage, but I don't know what the duration is, and I don't know if it stacks. Because if electricity stacks, then it's a pretty good buff. Like, you apply 50 stacks of electricity to somebody. I mean, not 50. You apply 10 stacks of electricity, and they take, like, 50 damage. Uh, but I'm not sure if that's the case. Helper bird. Yeah, that, that does not um, contract the rest. You know what? This is decent. 18% damage. Uh, I had a 25er. Let's try to go for the 25er again. I mean, if not the 25, at least let's get 20, you know, because you know, uh, the, the fact that the bouncy bullets, which is a chance to be gotten, happen to roll the moment I, uh, I got the 25 is very sad, but it is what it is, you know. I would definitely buy the bouncy bullets. There is like no doubt in my mind that the bouncy bullets was the right choice. Uh, yeah, here we go. Increase damage 25%. Ask and you shall receive. You just need to wait. You just need to wait it out. I mean, it doesn't matter if it got 20 damage or 50 damage because I'm not even able to see whatever the numbers are right now. <laughs> what you see is what I see, okay? Is there an option to maybe make things better? Nope. <laughs> there is no option for that at all. 3 to 1 go. Wait. Was 3 to 1 go part of this game before? I don't know. Whatever. Doesn't really matter. The reason why I'm playing with this uh, control, by the way, the wherever I target is where I shoot, is because this is the only way you can actually stay on the spot and move around. If you play the other mode, you cannot. SMG rotating gun, no. We're gonna go with a chance to electrify. I'm gonna take that. Uh, as what weapon I wanna get from that, uh, it's rocket launchers. <laughs> like, there is a rocket launcher choice, I want to get that. If not rocket launchers, sniper's minimum, because the sniper does like 100 damage, and then the first upgrade instantly makes it do 200 damage. And, uh, like, I'm doing right now 43, so the difference is huge, obviously. Uh, there is also an upgrade that gives us double damage. Whoop, now, now, now we got some opponents that are a bit dangerous. Like, I need to pay attention. Ammo speed, no. Three missiles around us. Yeah, that's gonna protect us from these crazy guys. So we got bomb uh, divers, and I just lost life from them. So let's move around a bit until I heal. And uh, I healed, so now we can stay here. Actually, you know what? We are very close to... Well, we lost life again. So let's run around again until I heal. 
as I said, uh, you can... Uh, yeah, you should always be full life, man. In this game, you should. You have no reason to not be full life. The moment you're not full life, just stop shooting, run around a bit, uh, fully heal, and then come back to wherever you want to go to. Because if you don't do that, well, at some point you will get surrounded and just instantly killed. Especially if you have two or three life, you won't be able to control anything. Also, I think I lost my shield, right? But the thing is, you can have only up to one shield, so the shield has to be something that refreshes. Otherwise, I would see more shields here, and I have stopped seeing shields from when I picked mine up. Uh, six missiles around us for even more protection. I don't care about base speed, like, who cares? Let's go with six around us for even more protection from these uh, bombers. And these bombers, and also more things that will chase us later, are the reason why I went for the poison trail. Like, you very often want to just run away from opponents, and uh, you can't really attack them if you're running away from them now, can you? Well, with the poison trail, you can. Buy yours now, uh, with the cheap price of, I think, the game costs like four bucks. Uh, so, yeah, there's that. Oh, run away. But uh, I want to point out that what you see is what you get. It's a very simplistic game right now. It's uh, like a, a quick little time saver. Oh, increased 21%. We're gonna take that. 21% is pretty decent. So, let's go. I really hope I'm gonna get the upgrade that gives us 200% more damage. There is an upgrade that gives us 200% more damage, but like 400% less... Um, uh, more spread. So, you no longer control where you shoot, but whenever uh, any bullet hits anything, it just kills it. So, <laughs> that is uh, by far the most important upgrade to get if you're lucky enough. Let's run away. That's why I have those cycling shots. And uh, honestly, until these black um, planes here stop doing their dive bombing. Yeah, we're gonna be moving around for almost the next 10 minutes of this game. Yep, as you see, this is full. It's gonna become full, but it's not gonna become max. 30% uh, damage, not good enough for me. Sniper, nah, I still vote for the rockets. Let's go with opponents have a chance to explode. As uh, that is gonna help us with uh, clearing out uh, masses of opponents in case they amass. But, I mean, I don't think they're gonna amass. Especially with the fact that we have a poison trail. So even if they amass, they will still get the poison and die. Now, as you see, we got those new planes here. Uh, these guys with the lines behind them. I mean, all of the planes have a lines. I just realized these blue guys here. Which uh, are practically... I mean, all of them are suicide bombers, but uh, still, <laughs> the, these things uh, drift around and are better at chasing you down. So this is another good reason of why I had the poison trail, because as long as I just run away, I'm good to go. Oh, also something else. Uh, in this game, you can dash, like, infinitely. You can just dash, 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 and you can go, what, high speeds, ammo speed. Why? Why is this a thing? I still don't want the sniper, man. I still, I, I'm still waiting for the rocket launcher. <laughs> I'm still trying for the rocket launcher. Uh, the upgrade that gives us double damage, uh, but crazy spread, is uh, for current weapons only. So there is also an incentive to get weapons early, so that when you get that, it gets applied to your new weapons. That is what it is. By the way, uh, the islands over here... <laughs> like, the what what is happening in the background does not make sense in comparison to what is happening in the foreground. Like, why are there so many ships going all around over the place? And uh, why are we below... Oh, this is an elite. Let's try to run a bit away because it's shooting like some rockets behind us. And then we chase it down like this. Whoop. And we do like a circle loop-de-loop. -loop. We go close to it and then we run away. We heal because the one thing that is the most dangerous thing to do is not have full life. Yeah, yeah I was not able to heal there. I had to shoot. 15% damage, pretty decent. Lifetime of poison trail, 9 missiles. Let's go with 9 missiles. Although I want to get my... Oh, I, I forgot to gas, gas, gas. You definitely need to gas, gas, gas all the time. Go through that thing and it's done. <laughs> That's why we have the rockets around us. Frozen enemies stay frozen for the rest of the game pretty much and then die. Fire rate, uh, but we lose damage. We definitely don't take that. And uh, this is the best upgrade. Minus one health. Who cares? I'm going to have four. Two base speed, decent. Two in speed, decent. Size, very good. And a double damage on current weapons. Uh, so we take that for sure. And now we move a lot faster, and also we do literally double damage right now. So pretty much everything dies with a single shot. I mean, my machine gun does 21, my SMG does 85. So yeah, it's it's death sentence all around. Let's blast through here. Uh, these these crazy opponents will stop appearing. These these bomb divers, whatever they're called, uh, at some point within the next I don't know year. But they will stop appearing. Grenade launcher, that's not what I want. I want a rocket launcher. Uh, increased lifetime of poison trail or higher chance to shock. Let's go. Let's let's go a bit more deep into the poison. Because the helper plane is gonna buff the poison in general. Like the poison trail makes it so that all poisons do more damage and stuff like that. I could have also had around me the poison bombs instead of these ones, but these bombs stack up to nine. So the moment you run into something, they just explode. Like I killed the boss right away. And these explosions do like 100 damage each. So if all nine pop on something, it's 900 damage. And in comparison to my shots that do 85 or whatever, yeah, 900 damage is obviously a lot, right? 
Uh, increase ammo speed by 20%. No fire three percent also very low. This is what I wanted. 400% spread, 200% damage on current weapons. We definitely take that. I don't care about where I shoot. I care about shooting in general. So now my normal attacks do 171. So it's a one shot on everything it hits. And my machine gun does... Uh, is that 20? I, I don't know how much my machine gun does right now. I cannot really see because it has to hit something. 171. I think it's the... I, th I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Because I see 121. Oh, I lost life. So let's sh stop shooting for a while. Just continue going in circles. Gas, gas, gas. Okay, I'm full life again. Let's shoot everything in front of us and behind us and pretty much wherever. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Wow, good upgrades. Uh, oh, poison damage plus two, but I'm going to go with the plus max health. Because honestly, four life is very dangerous to us. Uh, as I mean, I literally had four life previously and I was sitting down to heal. So imagine having four as my max life. It's it's dangerous. Anyway, let's continue smacking wherever. Uh, the SMG does its job. It just hits whatever and starts burning them and flaming them and poisoning them and, uh, you know, all the stats effects. Although I haven't gotten the 100% crit. Uh, not crit, electricity effect. No, I like how this guy's like, what is happening? <laughs> this guy's all the time. <laughs> and I'm, no, no, uh, no, we're gonna go with this. 7% chance to burn. He has constantly, he's constantly like shooting constantly. He's like, pum, 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 no. I like that he's going around. Like the animation of that guy is so awesome. I love it. And depending on what character you have, there is a different character sitting over there. So that's fun too. Anyway, let's continue going ta -ta 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 -ta, and just running around in circles because uh, this is the game pretty much. <laughs> I do enjoy it though. It's pretty chill. The graphic style. I disagree with like I, I I am a number cruncher guy and being barely able to see what it is I don't like it but still harm percent chance to do four damage over time which is not four it's seven so that's really good all poison damage plus two as I said all poison damage I'm gonna go the harm percent chance to electrify opponents assuming assuming that electricity stacks assuming that electricity stacks uh, because it said over the duration so it doesn't specify I'm assuming that it stacks if it doesn't stack it's very mediocre but if it stacks uh, I'm assuming that it stacks because it's a chance, right? If it wasn't a chance like fire is, for example, fire, I'm not assuming that it stacks because it's 100% chance to burn an opponent. Uh, but, uh, yeah, but electricity says a chance to electrify the opponent, so I would assume it stacks. I don't know, I don't know. Increase all poison damage, sniper addition, movement speed. No, we're gonna go with increase all poison damage. So now we have even more poison damage. Is my poison at 20? Is the poison the thing that says 20 all the time when I shoot somebody? Uh, because whenever I shoot, I think I see some 41s. I think the SMG is the 41s that appear. It's definitely not the bombs. Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. And now we're fighting helicopters. So uh, now, for example, we don't need to move around anymore. We just can shoot in circles all the time. Although the helicopters have like a death on explode effect. Like if you see they, they shoot out their coppers, that's how they attack you. Can I can I get something good on this? <laughs> missile! I found it! I found the missile launcher! Let's go! <laughs> yep, that's, that's what it looked like. It's just a missile launcher. Wait, did it just do only 10 damage? Please don't tell me it tries to bounce off and it doesn't explode because of that. Because if that's the case, then it's... I'm so sad. I'm so sad it doesn't explode. Yeah, I don't think it explodes. Nope, it does explode. Nice. <laughs> as long as it's explode, I'm a happy camper. Now, theoretically, if you play in advanced controls, you uh, can control where it shoots. Like, you can run forward and at the same time attack backward. But uh, lifetime trail and add plus one damage to poison. We're gonna go with this. But the thing is, you, you don't want that. <laughs> like, uh, wh what you want is to be able to... By the way, I'm, I'm healing here for a moment. Okay. I was unable to heal, obviously. Come on, heal us, please. Thank you. Uh, what you want to do is to be able to stay in the middle and just not and just not move. This, this is what you want to be able to do. And for you to be able to do that, you have to have this scheme control. Wherever your target is, where you, you go. I don't know why, but for some reason, if you play with the other control mode, you, you cannot um, drift on the spot. So I'm not even going to show style control mode because, uh, first of all, like, you can see it. Uh, like, no, you cannot see it. Let's go with this chance to freeze opponents. Just heal up. The reason I'm not going to do the other control, I'm going to do the other control in, in a bit. Okay. Actually, not in this run specifically. I'm going to do it in uh, the next run if I do another one. I'm, I can also just showcase it after the run is done. Oh, up. Helicopter is behind us. Da, 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 da. You know what? Now is a good chance to, to showcase it. Advanced control. Yep, continue. And uh, this is what it looks like. As you see, I'm I'm not really able to control the ship that much. I mean, I'm not sure if you can understand, but... No! No, 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 no. Right now is not a good chance to die. That's why I didn't want that to happen. I need to boost right away out of there. Out, out, out. Okay, time to heal. Time to heal. Run. Boost out. Okay, we're fighting like bees. Bees are who cares. 
Really, it's only this boss that I'm afraid of. These are easier than whatever we were fighting previously. I almost died there. Uh, let's go with chance to freeze. Okay, let's now kill the B boss. Okay, the B boss did not die. <laughs> yeah, the rocket does actually bounce. That's so stupid. That's so stupid. I made a huge mistake of picking that, but who cares? Increase weapon spots by one. I can have another ship, or I can have my life back. Actually, I lost one life previously, and now I can get six. Lose, I lose the things we gained previously and get my size back, but also get 25% damage on top of whatever else. Or we can go with even more... Oh, the bullets go slower. But they're bigger, and also they damage more. Or just get another weapon. Uh, I mean, I haven't even leveled up this to the max. I can get another weapon, though. Now let's go with this. Let's go with the bullets move slower. I have never seen what slow bullets look like, but they're supposed to be big now. Wow! Wow, no idea what that's supposed to even do. <laughs> the rocket is so stupid. The rocket is so stupid. Such a bad mistake. Oh, you can have the helper plane. Oh, what? I, I did not know that. Like, seriously, I did not know that. The last time I had the poison plane, I never found that thing again, ever. The helper plane. So, half the things I said are wrong. But you still can only have one mounted weapon that is targeted. So, that's definitely correct. Okay, so the bullets going slower is really bad. Because more opponents come close to us more easily. But I am freezing them, so... As you understand, as I saw it, as I said, the bees are easier than everything else we were fighting. Like the helicopters and all those. Yeah, the bees are easier than those. Freeze missile attack, whatever, ammo speed, fire rate. Why? Why? Fire rate 40% of that plane. We're getting very small upgrades. You know what? If I get even a 10% damage boost or a 10% attack speed boost... I mean, if I get a 10% attack speed boost, it's gonna be busted. But if I get, like, a 10% damage boost on that, I'm gonna take it. On the SMG, that is. I think the game looks at what your damage value is and then decides, you know what, you have enough damage on that weapon, I'm gonna give you less uh, percentage based damage. Which is very unfair to be honest, because that means you want to first level up your weapons and then pick up all the percentage based damage things. Uh, because right now I have like, yeah, look at this, I must be fire rate 2%, no, I'm, I'm not accepting that. I increase damage by 100%, so that means my little helper flame from 10 now does 20 damage and has a 40% attack speed boost, whatever. I still have my ring of explosives. I think I never got the shield back. I think I never ever got the shield back. So there's that. I have to remember that there is a boss is going to appear in the last minute. But uh, yeah, this is pretty much it. We have won. We have complete control over everything. Obviously, uh, this is how it goes in this game. Like, if you can win once, you can always ever win. Like, I did a win off screen on my own. Like, I got my first win alone. And now, you can no longer win. Because you get enough unlockables. 3% damage? Like, are you serious right now? Uh, let's go with 4% chance to freeze opponents. Because why not? Oh no, opponents are trying to hit us. Guess what? We have a bunch of, bu a bunch of bullet bu bouncing things. The rocket is a joke. I, I was so insistent on it. And... Yeah, bounce. I, I did not realize that it bounces. Yeah, what a what an oversight. What an oversight, and also what a bad design, by the way. Uh, not only is it bad because it bounces instead of exploding, but it's double bad because for some reason it loses all its momentum when it hits something. So it it doesn't even it isn't even able to go to the other side of the bounce. It does, and I think most of my bullets have that problem. I think I made a huge mistake by making my bullets slower. Three percent chance to freeze. That sounds decent. Um. Uh, 4% damage. You know what? This is this is like never gonna get a good roll. I'm gonna still try it though. I'm insistent. If anything, I'm not persistent. Oh no, another rocket of mine that comes back to me. Who would have thought? We're still fighting bees. And what do you think is the next opponent gonna be? By the way, the bees are what? Like random, random, randomly opponents up here. Like out of the blue. Now we're fighting bees. What's gonna come next? Huh? What do you think is gonna come next? Take a wild guess. Like if you closed your eyes and would guess randomly what the next opponent would be. Was it Mosquito? Because Mosquito is the answer. And they just appeared like the moment I wanted to do, do the thing. With you guys trying to guess. Mosquito is the answer. Yeah, bullets being slower, definitely a bad choice. Definitely a bad choice. Never do that. I, I should never take that. I'm, I'm never gonna take that ever again. Uh, if I play this game again. Wow! 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 Let's take this, increase the damage of the rocket, whatever. I'm, I'm really disappointed with the fact that the dev has decided to make sure that you get percentage-based damage based on your current damage, because... Yeah, because... The boss drop always gives you 100% more damage, like the specific one I picked up. And the thing with the spread thing, the, the thing that says that your bullets spread crazily but you get the 200% more damage, yeah, that thing also always gives you 200% more damage. So it's extremely unfair that if you find that thing first, then the game no longer gives you good upgrades for your weapons. But if you don't have anything damage related, the game just gives you straight up good things. Like, ah, 
I, I don't know, man. I, I don't enjoy uh, on-purpose nerf design. That's uh, that's my opinion. Like, obviously. Like, if you have ever seen anything on this channel, I am an advocate. Like, what is ammo speed? Ammo speed is that they fly faster. Yeah, ammo speed is that they fly faster. You know what? I'm gonna take ammo speed. Whatever. I'm gonna take the stupid ammo speed. So that these bullets at least bounce around, you know? Because the other bullets are complete trash right now. They are extremely slow. At least we have some kind of bouncing bullets that are gonna protect us just a smidge, I guess. I don't even know. I prefer it over, like, 3% damage. And now it's at full level! Although we want it to become max level! I also don't understand that. Like, why is there full level and then also max level? It um, doesn't make sense to me. <laughs> I mean, you even have those little pips. I mean, if, if it wasn't pips, it could have been like advanced one, advanced two, and then full and then max. Then I would understand it. But it's like you have seven pips, six pips, and then when they fill, you write full. And then after that, you also write max. Why, why is it stop on max? And why doesn't it go up to ultra max and then mega max and then legendary max upgrade? Like, you see, I, I can draw the line wherever I want. Let's get the 4% damage and be done with this stupid thing. Whatever game. 4%, 4%, whatever you desire. Whatever you desire. Unless... Is there any chance that those percentage-based damages are actually numbers and the game just says 4% because oh, this, this is the opponent. This is the opponent. The, the one ranged opponent just arrived. Let's heal up and we're gonna chase him down and win the game. Okay, just healed up. Let's go find that one opponent. Uh, if, if he's like somewhere over... Yep, here he is. I see him. Shoot, please. One, two... Three. Oh, no, it's my turn. Da -da 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 -da. I missed almost everything. Run! Run! Okay, one, two, three, go. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, run, run, run. Boom. I mean, that's it pretty much. This is how the fight's gonna go. I'm just uh, making it feel extremely uh, crazy, but it's not crazy. We won. <laughs> Frozen enemies, 50% more damage. Explosive, do 20% more damage. And uh, yeah, we become big again. Back to our good old size. You know what? Let's go big again. I'm back to what I used to be. I feel like I changed colors. Whatever. I'm big now! Yay! And I have 11 life, which is borderline damage immune. But yay! <laughs> yeah, it is actually borderline damage immune. Uh, death immune, not death. De damage immune, definitely not. But de death immune, yeah. Um, shoot out more powerful missiles. Uh, might as well. Not that it really matters. Oh, it's like an atomic bomb now. Nice. Still, not that it matters, though. Pop, 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 pop. Yep. Destroy everybody and everything and uh, now you're gonna see why I said that uh, if you win once you pretty much unlock everything because this is literally my second win right now uh, It's about to happen in 10 seconds. So you know what? Let's fly around. Let's do the victory lap Let's just rush through everything here. It doesn't matter that I lost the life here or there I mean at the end of the day, we will definitely win in the last two seconds Ooh, And we want da -da -da -dum. That's gonna be like the victory screen. You win. Up. Time to survive. Nothing. 22,000. Do you see this number here that we got? You see this 22,000 that we got? Yeah, this is a bug. <laughs> the game did not expect anybody to win. And uh, yeah, uh, by the way, there are like our characters become invisible during air rolling or faster base speed on all planes or like increase your max health or no special, but he has good turn speed, repair speed, medium, defense good and toughness very good. Like he gives stats to the plane himself. Although I don't even know what these means. These should definitely be actual numbers. Uh, but yeah, we have the guy that levels up faster but has trash effects because obviously levels give you abilities and abilities are always busted. But anyway, it doesn't matter. I'm let me let me showcase here how much money we have. We have twenty four thousand. This is how much money I got like the first run. And like these planes costed four thousand, two thousand, four thousand. These stages costed a thousand to three thousand. And then as you see, this the, the weapons costed the amounts you see. Like this costed three, three and three, I think. And like yeah, here I can just buy everything done i just literally bought everything in the game with two wins with two wins you can just literally unlock everything there is no meta progression there isn't anything to buff up which is a bit sad in my opinion uh i would prefer if there was uh is, is one of these oh none of these is the machine gun we previously had oh i didn't realize that you cannot actually start with a machine gun i have i had ak-47 by the way you cannot see the stats of the weapons but if you go over here at the interactive which is very bad in general but like over here interactive select screen uh here you can this is awesome by the way but it's super buggy <laughs> here you can see the stats i don't know why they made it this way and here you actually you know shoot and uh decide to change weapons damn what okay crazy bullet speed crazy damage but very bad fire rate what does this look like okay fair enough switch around oh this is also an awesome weapon fire rate even crazier damage who cares about the shotgun? Change up. Okay, that's not a shotgun. Shorty. Dual pistols. Yep, obviously not. 
Desert Eagle, obviously not. M6, this is uh, not the one we had, we had the AK, this is the one we had, which is the most, the best weapon in the game, and then we got the Glock, the starting weapon of this whole game, and then we also can change the planes, hunting rifle, uh, what else have we all playing, you know, the speed plane, oh, you know what, let's uh, let's do an Uzi run, because memes, although, it didn't, yeah, let's do an Uzi run, because memes, and with a machine gun, it's an Uzi machine gun run, and uh, as a character, yeah, I need to, I need to um, change characters, <laughs> Where is the where's the go back to menu? Yeah, you, you can't even go out of here, out of that menu at all. You can only start the game. Uh, let's play this guy. Spin speed good, repair speed good, defense medium, toughness very good. Right? What is this guy? Faster base speed, very good, very good. Defense bad and toughness good. Three monks life, very bad, bad, good, medium. You know what, let's just go with the, I don't have any stats, but uh, I'm good, medium, good, and very good on those. And uh, let's go with normal stage select, because I want to just pick up the magnum. Let's go with this, the machine gun. Let's go in the grass, and uh, let's see if we're gonna survive this. Although, I'm pretty sure we're gonna die, because this is not a good build. <laughs> but uh, still. Uh, tips on how to win this game, just buy the AK. Just buy the AK right away, and you should be winning. Yeah, this is this is like such a trash. <laughs> I'm gonna be a poison plane, just so you guys know. <laughs> I'm gonna be running around and just poisoning everything. Yep, this is this is a bad run. <laughs> let's go. da 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 Fire him, fire him, fire, fire. Wow, I'm super fast and I almost died. Let's go repair speed, I would say. Uh, yep. And I am uh, I just lost the life I just lost. <laughs> I whoa, whoa, whoa. Opponents multiply in front of our eyes. Because the spawning in this game is a bit weirdish. I guess I was too fast for its own good. <laughs> I love how fast we're flying. I really love it. Although we're not gaining a single level because I'm not gaining kills. I do enjoy the fact that this game does not have XP that drops on the ground. Like, you see, this is another game that, you know, showcases that XP on the ground has nothing to do with you needing to move or not. In this game, you need to definitely move. By the way, this is how the game normally goes. Like, normally, this is how the game goes. You go around, hit these guys, and then fly away. Bullets. Oh, I have a second. Yeah, 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 we're gonna get another one of these. I'm gonna be a super SMG build. I'm gonna be the craziest SMG build around. Da -da 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 well, let's go. I love it, man. It's it's stupid, by the way, and it's definitely not powerful. But it's fun. Uh, especially when I start gaining, you know, flame opponents, electrify opponents, and pretty much any stats effect under the earth. Um, ammo speed, useless. Zoom out, I would say, yeah. Let's go zoom out, because I definitely need to know where opponents are so I can easily dodge them. And when I say easily, I mean not really that easily. Stop shooting for a moment. I love it. Oh, we're almost dead. We almost died there, but repair speed is saving us. And let's go. Maybe I should have gone with the other one that said that when I flip, I'm damage immune. I rate 7%. Damage 32%. We'll definitely take this before I take anything else for damage. Whoop. Ziggy zaggy. And now we need to repair. Let's wait. By the way, any machine gun weapon in this game is really bad just because of the fact that you need to repair more. And like, do you see how fast it overheats? That, that's definitely something that the dev needs to fix. Like, the, this overheat is a joke. The fact that the moment you click the button, it's like instantly full. Yeah, what? Like, why is that the case? Just because I have a machine gun, I'm permanently nerfed. Like, I I'm unable to heal. That's the idea here. And it's not like the machine guns are crazy good. Like, the snipers are a lot better. Where you just tap once and everything dies in one hit. So, there is no point in having these be more dangerous. You know what? I definitely need to have some elemental effect here happening. Because this is just straight up not happening. Poison bomb, no piercing. I would say let's start with piercing. This, this is not what I meant. Whoop, ziggy zaggy. Let's continue. Da, 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 da. I mean, yeah, maybe piercing is helping here and there. Whoop. <laughs> I mean, these guys don't even lose life. I love it. I love it. I definitely want to get the, the burn effect and the electrify effect. Mostly the electrify effect because I still believe it stacks. Fire 2%. Crazy good. Opponents explode. I guess we're gonna go with exponents explode. Oh, oh, I love this so much. The fact that we're flying like the fastest thing in the universe. I love it. I really do. Uh, not that it's good or anything, but still. I definitely need to get the 2% spread thing. So that I have an even higher chance of uh, just hitting opponents while I'm drive buying. Because right now I need to target them. I want to actually my bullets to fly so sideways that I hit opponents without even looking at them. Let's continue. By the way, my bullets always shoot forwards. Right? So the... Oh, found it. Nice. My bullets always, always shoot forwards. Even if I play with advanced controls, that does not mean that my bullets will stop going forwards. No, the advanced controls helps only and exclusively only for that mounted weapon thing. And only for that. And like, for you to be able to control the mounted weapon thing, you pretty much lose your control to control your ability to control the plane perfectly. 90% damage, that's a good amount. Might as well take that. Um, I could have had like a 25 or obviously like previously I said, but um, so let's just get the 19% and be gone with this. Zoom out, I would say. 
Yeah, definitely. And I also definitely want to get my nine bombs again. Because, um, you know, these are useful. And can I get the trail, please? Have one ice block? Nope. Zoom out even further? Nope. We're gonna go with burn opponents. Because right now I'm not doing any damage other than burn. Like, all of these are burning. Plane that follows you can deal damage. No, I want the poison plane, honestly. 35% damage. We're gonna definitely take that. 35% damage is borderline useful. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Nope, we're losing life. Let's stop shooting. Uh, probably 2%. Wow. Text plane, more speed while you have it active. Pretty useless. All of these are trash. Um... Speed for the memes? No, there is like a poison shield. Let's stay. But I want the bombs. I definitely don't want this. Let's... Let's... I mean, I don't know. Let's get the speed thing for the memes. For the memes! I still don't know how the shields exactly work. I think they never refresh. I think you just take them once, you have the buff forever, and then you're supposed to play perfectly for the rest of the game, like from the, from the moment you pick them up. Oh, that's a boss. Any bizarre ah, let's go with more damage on the fire here, on the fire department, and we did not get hit. Avoid, avoid, avoid. I don't think we're gonna be able to defeat the elite, like, just at all. Let's loop around and try to burn it. If I hit one, at least one, I'm good to go. Let's go with the zoom out. Yeah, like, if I am able to hit the elite once and burn it, I think burn is permanent. Okay, you know what, I'm gonna do the classic tactic of run out! <gasps> I have one life. I'm dead. Ah! Ooh! That was a very panicky moment. Uh, what? 94% damage? Yeah, this is like, the game is like, okay, you're gonna die. No, wait, this. Okay, we're back in the game. Back in the game, like nothing happened. Oh, by the way, the boss, the elites disappear. So if I don't get the kill pretty quickly here, we will literally lose a buff. I'm gonna stay, stand my ground. Okay. Ah, I died. <laughs> I didn't see my life enough. I didn't see my life enough. That's okay, the, the the ship was trash anyway. Let's go back to the screen and go with the sniper this time. Yeah, let's go with the M16. Uh, not the speed plane though. Actually, yeah, let's go with the speed plane. I don't care. Let's go with the speed plane. Let's even play the third stage. Nothing changes actually, it's like just the background change. So there you go. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the speed plane and just have a snipe. Insta kill whatever we shoot. Yeah, bye, 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 bye. Easy enough, you know, easy enough. And it rotates very fast. Shoots bullets. Oh! Shoots bullets with precision that deal 3 damage. Yeah, this is the machine gun we previously had. I could go for another sniper, by the way. You know what? Let's try to force another sniper. And let's get the helper poison here. Uh, let's try to force another sniper. I want to try a two sniper run, if I'm able to. Uh, the snipers are purple. And that red thing was the machine gun that we had in the very first run, which is obviously a busted weapon, you know. Whoop, whoop, snipe, snipe. Snip, snip. <laughs> Random shots. Uh, 30 more damage. I don't want this weapon. I wanted this in the first run, by the way. Game be like... Let's get the 30% more damage. Now it's, uh, yeah, 58, I think. More 50. I would assume it's 58. I'm attacking a bit too slow for my own good here. Oh, avoid. Let's go. Boom, 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 boom. Everything is a one shot. I definitely need piercing, etc. Shotgun. Uh, 10 damage per bullet. Shotgun plus sniper. I could do that. Let's go shotgun and sniper. The two opposites. Let's heal for a moment and go. Yeah, this is a combo that does not need to reload that often, if anything. If, if at all, like, I'm not gonna be needing to recall. Like, right now I have my button pressed down, and as you see, this goes up very slowly. Uh, I can take this right away. No, if I take this right away, we're gonna lose all the possible uh, level ups we can get. And now that I have a 20% less heating up, now I think I borderline don't even get... Yeah, now I'm permanently in repair mode for the rest of this game, because my weapons, like, attack extremely slowly. Uh, and uh, I do enjoy the, the whole effect of a shotgun something and dies. 46% damage, we take that for sure. <laughs> yeah, now now it's gonna be doing 15. Yep, I guess it rounded up very nice. Shoot him. Shoot him. I mean, maybe not. Whoop, whoop, we got hit there. Whoop, we got hit again. And we're repairing. And we're full. Full. Not full yet. Oh, we got hit again. Oh, yeah, that, that's how the game normally goes. Just so you know. <laughs> that's why I'm saying that you should go with the AK-47. Like, it's it's the best weapon in the game by far. It just, it's just... Uh, in the beginning, it only two-shots these guys. But the moment you get a single upgrade for it, it will one-shot them. And then you win. 22% uh, there. Actually, let's go with fire rate on this thing. Let's go with 11 fire rate. Let's have a, a little sniper machine gun here that uh, one-shots opponents. Up, 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 run. <laughs> I love it so much. The feeling of flying around is the awesome part. Uh, the gameplay itself, um, I don't know, man. It's a bit weird to need to always target opponents like this. 
Increase damage by 60%. I would say yeah to that. So, shoot him. Boom. Boom. Fly around. I love it so much. Up. Drive by. The drive by plane of doom. Although I would like to have a poison trail of my own. Up. Oh, we're a bit out of. Um, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Panic. Panic. <laughs> I'm kidding. Let's go. Whatever I'm looking at just dies. And uh, the fact that I have this uh, very, very fast healing is good. Poison trail. Now. I don't want this yet. Once again. Um. Ah, let's go with zoom out the camera, man. Whoop. Boom. Not that I need the camera itself yet, but uh, it is a useful thing to have in general. And also, I really enjoy the fact that uh, I can just blast once in a while and I will heal at some point. Although I always reset the heal every time I take a shot, but boom, I got it. Nice. Are you kidding me? Boom, I got it. Nice. Now I got it. <laughs> now I actually got it. Nice. Let's continue going as far away as possible and then backtrack shooting. Stay away from everybody. Increase lifetime of poison trail. Might as well. Run. <laughs> I love it. I love how fast we're moving. Uh, although, uh, like, be between opponents, etc. Here, let's uh, bob and weave, bob and weave. Although we lose life because I'm not good at this, but ooh, I don't care. I really enjoy the healing mechanic of this game. The only thing I don't enjoy is, as I said, uh, first of all, the graphics. Second, actually, replayability is also a really big issue in this game. Like, a huge issue. 22%. Uh, actually, 15% fire rate is a, a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Yeah, look, this already attacks fast enough to be useful. Now I just need to uh, fly away. No, now I just need to get the um, less cooldown on weapon. Not less cooldown. The the weapons overheat less. Yeah, that thing has a very big effect. Uh, it was just not visible because I had crazy attack speed previously. 25% damage while the shield is active. I'm gonna take that. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take that. Actually, helper plane, maybe. You know what? Let's get the helper plane going. Now we have two planes that help us. We have... Oh, 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 I'm at one life. Panic, panic, panic. Regen, regen, regen. Okay, okay. Oh, and we're alive. <laughs> I don't know why everything was robotic there. Whoop. Drive by. Whoop. Let's go. I got hit. Oh, boss time. Let's avoid maybe the boss. I like that the boss goes a bit faster than the opponents do. Because this way I can loop through him. Nice. Bye. Boom. Boom. And let's go back. What did I hit? Armor speed, fire rate, 16%. Let's go with 16% fire rate for sure. Oh, the sniper attacks pretty fast now. Decently fast, that is. Whoop. Oh, I got hit. Let's run. Whoop. Avoid, avoid. Nope, I got hit again. When I say avoid, it doesn't mean that I avoided. It just means that I want to avoid. Uh, excuse me, can I find the plane again? Here it is. Now I need to loop it from the other side. Come on, man. Oh, I'm at one life. Yes, I got it. -hoo -hoo -hoo. One more weapon, 200% explosion damage, and the slow weapons. No, we're gonna go with one more weapon. If those are the choices, I'm gonna go with more weapons. Pistol, yes. I'm gonna go with this. <laughs> Pistol, yes. Oh, you know what? I should also go with the sniper mounted weapon. That definitely is gonna help us, because those do 100 damage. Like, my normal attack doesn't even do 100 damage, and my normal attack is supposed to be a sniper anyway, so. Hit him, hit him. Uh, what weapon would I like to get now? You know what? Another sniper, actually. If I get another one of those uh, one-tap type of things... By the way, opponents don't even get one-shot anymore. <sighs> Some of fire on this. Missile around us. I mean, this is really good. Let's go with the missile around us. If we're still alive at the end of this. Whoop. Because YOLO. Because YOLO. I love it, man. I love flying through opponents. Although, we're borderline dead here. If I don't stop doing stupid stuff. <laughs> yeah, that, that's fun. That's fun to me. It's fun to me. It's fun to me just running around having fun. Yep, boop. Avoid. You first saw Sift the destroy the game, destroyer of games, and now you're seeing Sift the just showcasing the replayability of this game because honestly, that, that is it. Like, you saw the first one was everything you can get, pretty much. The rest is like, now, now you're just playing with yourself. Whoa, I'm almost dead. Oh, I got the cooldowning. The cooldowning. The cooling down. I think I will no longer overheat the weapons now. Let's test. Yeah, now I'm pressing the button. I am having the button held right now, and as you see, the, the heat doesn't even happen anymore. Yeah, it was not visible previously because I had two SMGs. Uh, no, I just have one uh, machine gun. That, that was the main issue there. Uh, plus one SMG. Wait, semi? SMG is semi-machine gun? What does SMG mean? Semi-automatic machine gun. Semi? Yeah, I think S is semi, right? Oh, whatever, it doesn't really matter. 
Uh, now, no, I'm not gonna take this yet because I still search for the last weapon. Let's go with three missiles around us. I don't think the game is gonna become harder anymore. Like, um, most most of the time the hardiness... Oh, I might be flexing a bit too early. Let's heal. Turn around, destroy him. Man, this, this plane is so fun. I love it. Oh, we lost life. But we healed it right away because I'm awesome. I'm running through opponents on purpose. I still have not found my poison trail, which I would really, really, really... I have two life. Panic. Pani. I'm full. I still would like to have my poison trail of my own. And also, obviously, the poison damage that we could have gotten from the boss. Whoop, I got hit there. <laughs> running through because YOLO. Uh, let's go with zoom out a bit so that I can YOLO a bit better. Uh-oh, one life. Feels like whenever I level up is the main point of when I die. Yeah, I guess because I mostly level up whenever I'm sitting still and attacking opponents. Shotgun. Oh, run, run, run. We're missing. Oh, we're missing a life. Ooh, look at this. That was a huge mistake, but I had fun. I had fun. I had fun. At the end, uh, maybe I should have leveled up my movement speed a bit more before I yoloed myself off the existence. But uh, yeah, I think that's it pretty much. I, I want to test something. I want to test something that I never tested. Is this character here damage immune all the time? The becomes invisible during air rolling. And she also has turn speed very good and repair speed good. So I want to see. Does she actually become damage immune if I just straight up spam the space? I'm obviously going to do this with a machine gun because I don't really want to do this run, honestly. So let's see. Does she just straight up become damage immune? Machine gun going up very fast. Wait, she she does not. Like, well, the damage immunity is a thing, but she definitely. Whoa! Look how fast she goes. Whoa! I died obviously because I love it. I love it though. I love it. I love it. It's the meme. It's the meme of it. Oh, I got zero coins. Let's go. I got a good old F. Anyway, that is going to be it for today. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, drop a like on the channel. I'm not sure I'm gonna play this again, but uh, I mean, you can do it. I think it's like a three bucks game, maybe four bucks game. It's a pretty cheapish game, I as far as I know. The replayability is not there yet, but I mean, I have no idea what the dev is gonna do. If it's gonna evolve, it's gonna get more patches, it's gonna get more things or whatnot. Uh, but yeah, this is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. The game was fun. Uh, I think the graphic thing is, you know, it's it's on purpose, obviously. I mean, nobody is uh, creating a game, seeing that and being like, yep, that's how, uh, that's how it is. No, it's just, yeah, that's how we wanted it to be. So, um, yeah, the graphic things, everybody wants, you know, enjoys it or not, everybody to their own. Uh, the game just needs a bunch of replayability and maybe a couple of changes here or there, but I don't know what exactly you can change. Uh, maybe add a bunch more upgrades, that could be a thing, like a bunch, a bunch, a bunch more upgrades, like, uh, you know, the garlic effect, whoever's around you gets hit, uh, shoot uh, bullets backwards, or uh, pretty much most of the upgrades that exist in Bounty of One would fit in this game, I think. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's another survivor's uh, bullet hell, bullet heaven game, so it does something different, you know, it, it, the challenge comes from being able to hit the opponents or not, but if you just follow whatever I did in the first run, you will win, okay, the only thing you have to do is buy the AK, it costs like 4,000 something, it doesn't matter, you're gonna form it up, buy the AK, and then you're gonna just win, so that, that's how you win this game, and then buy like the, the, the second ship, but you don't need it, I, the first time I won, I won with the first uh, flyer, so you just need an AK and nothing else. A bit lucky on the rolls, a bit lucky on the upgrades, but otherwise, like, that's it. Uh, and if you're not lucky enough, just get a plane that has two bullet slots, because the first plane does not even have two bullet slots, so... Uh, weapon slot. Whatever, man. I'm, I'm, I'm over... Like, uh, it's done. The video is done. It's over. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. Drop a like and subscribe if you want. Helps out the channel if I already didn't mention it. Thanks for all the Patreon supporters. As always, they help. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's it for this game. They sent me a key. I played it. It is what it is. If you enjoyed it, buy it. If you don't enjoy it, don't buy it. Um, if you, like, you can do whatever you want. You know what? Give me a second here. Give me one second. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, yeah, so the game is like right now for 13% less off. I think it's like 4 euros. That would be, I think, 5 bucks. So normally it costs 5 bucks. Right now you can find it like for 4 something. Um, and you know, you, I just showed you everything there is, so if you enjoyed what you saw and want to play this too, do it. Anyway, that is going to be it for today, though, this time, really. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and see you guys around.